This video will take you through how to create the main body for your toy truck project. Again, there are a number of different sizes that we will be referring to, so please make sure you do look at your worksheet. And we'll start by getting the main outline of the body created. So again, into File, into New, ensure that you've selected Metric, and rather than clicking here and creating, if we simply double click, it will give us a new file. So we're going to create a 2D sketch this time. I'm going to select this plane and I'm going to use my line command and I want to do this as one continuous line, not start and stopping. And can you see the little symbol that appears? And that tells me that that line is perpendicular to the line that I've just done. You can see the 90 degree angle. So it's important that we ensure that everything is going to be nice and straight. Again, at this stage, not worrying about the sizes. And if I just hover over, you'll see I've got that little dotted line. And that tells me that point is right below this one here. I've now done a nice continuous loop. The dimensions we're going to add this bottom size here is going to be 100 and things will start to look a little bit peculiar for a while until we get all the dimensions in. Our size here is 70. Our next one is going to be 50 and our last size that we're putting in here is going to be 35. So that gives us the basic shape. We're now going to put in the position for the holes that will take the axles. So again, I'm going on to my circle command. And I'm going to dimension. And the size here I'm looking for is 10. And now I need to get this in the correct position. So I'm going to just zoom into this so you can see clearly what I'm doing with my dimensions. So the dimension I'm looking for between our edge here and the center of the circle is to be 15. The distance between my center and this edge here, that size I'm looking for is 10. So that's we got one circle in the right position. I need to do the same at the other side. So again, I'm going to go to circle and again, if I just hover, I can make sure that I've got it at the same level. Again, dimension and my size is 10. I'll zoom into this just using the wheel on my mouse and I'll ensure that the distance between the center and this front and the size we're looking for is 15 and between here and here and you'll notice that, that goes to 10 because we made sure it was lined up with the previous circle so that's us now got the basic profile done so we can finish the sketch we can extrude here's the part we want to extrude and the distance this time will be 50 so again i can use little box at the top here so I can orientate this in a position that I'm happy with. So that now completes the main body. Please ensure that you do save this into your own folder, simply calling it main body. Thank you.